friends, it's Miss Suzanne. Friends all over the country this week in classrooms everywhere, kindergarten classrooms and middle school classrooms and high school classrooms, all of our school kids are celebrating a very special day. Because this week, all over the country, school kids are celebrating their 100th day of school. Think about it, we've been in school for 100 days. And oh my goodness, this year school has been very, very different, hasn't it? We've learned in our classrooms, and we've learned in our kitchen tables. We've learned at our special rooms that our folks have set up for us to learn in. School's been very different. And friends, we are a class that has learned unlike any other class in the history of schools. No one's ever done what we've done. And we are so proud of everything we've learned. So today I thought we would read a book about one classroom and how they're celebrating their 100th day. And the teacher's name is Miss Bindergarten and she teaches a kindergarten. So let's see what they do in their class to celebrate 100 days of school. Tomorrow we celebrate, said Miss Bindergarten, the 100th day of kindergarten. 100 days of friends, 100 days of fun, 100 days of darling, dazzling, winning work you've done. So, remember that tomorrow all of you must bring 100 of some wonderful 100-full things. That night, Adam's fort is finished. Brenda's half asleep. Christopher's 100 blocks tumble in a heap. Miss Bindergartner's garden gets ready for the 100th day of kindergarten. The next morning, Danny counts out cereal. Emily fills a base. Franny draws a picture of her 100-year-old face. Miss Bindergarten gets ready for the 100th day of kindergarten. Gwen creates a poster. Henry claps and cheers. Ian brings a relative who lives 100 years. Ian's a turtle. And can you believe it, friends? Turtles do live 100 years. Some even live longer than that. Miss Bindergarten gets ready for the 100th day of kindergarten. Jessie pokes her polka dots. Kiki carries tarts. Lenny hugs a bag full of hundred candy bears. Miss Bindergarten gets ready for the hundredth day of kindergarten. Maddie's bells to ting-a-ling. Noah tooty toots. Ophelia, Ophelia's stuck with stickers from her hat down to her boots. That's a lot of stickers, a hundred stickers, oh my goodness. Miss Bindergarten gets ready for the hundredth day of kindergarten. Patricia sorts her crayons. Quentin revs toy cars. Raffi lifts the lid up on 100 dinosaurs. Miss Bindergarten is almost ready for the hundredth day of kindergarten. Sarah checks her art ant farm. Tommy flies his kite. Ursula, Ursula's bag is heavy, but Vicky's bunch is light. Friends, do you notice something about the first letter of these names? It sounds like the alphabet. Miss Bindergarten is all ready for the 100th day of kindergarten. 
Wanda whoops and hollers. Xavier shakes his seeds. Yolanda pounds and Zachary Blair Boogie with their beads. Congratulations, says Miss Findergarten. Without more delay, let's celebrate the 100th day. Wow, my goodness, what a fun story. So what kinds of things can we collect for our 100th day? We can collect Cheerios and, and, and gummy bears and stickers, but maybe we can collect 100 hugs or 100 kisses. That's a lot of kisses. Anyway, just remember every day is one day closer to learning something you never learned before. Sometimes you have to make mistakes. Sometimes you have to make a hundred mistakes. But for every time you make a mistake, it's a chance to think about things and try them a different way. And before you know it, you'll get where you wanna go. So you all have a wonderful hundredth day of kindergarten and we'll see you real soon. Bye-bye, friends.